Hello, today is October 24th and we are at the very tail end of the year. We're expecting the real killing frost to come, gosh, within the next day or two. I know I saw a bee jump around over here and I'm just trying to find it. He might even be totally inside the flower at this point, but um, yeah, they're visiting the snapdragons, which they don't normally do. Um, normally the salvias go in nuts. Um, I was just able to pick a few things here in the garden. Um, this Monardo bee balm never did bloom. Um, I've got a couple of last tiny sunflowers, one gladiolus, a couple of, of uh, snapdragons. And you can see that we are really just about done. There's one more gladiolus back here that might be harvestable if it gets another day or two. Um, the larkspur has given a little second bloom. Uh, the dahlias are already dead and gone um, and, you know, experienced a low temperature last week. Um, but the roses are still actually pushing out a few blooms in the back there. The tomatoes are done. The gladiolus that I got in the ground here a little late, um, they are, you know, I've managed to get a couple of, of um, stalks off of them, like this one here, which is, I think, going to be Adam, A-T-O-M. Uh, a few other things are growing. Again, more of those knockout roses. Let's see. Oh, you know what? I do want to make sure that I catch just because I was really excited about it. I've put in um, a bunch of scabiosa from seed, um, which, you know, is a perennial. It doesn't normally do anything year one. Um, but you can see some of them are actually getting some real foliage. And one has pushed a couple of buds. Um, and I don't expect them to bloom before the killing frost comes in the next couple of days, but I will harvest it um, nonetheless uh, just for fun. So I hope everyone's having a great end of October and uh, talk to you soon. If this is my nephew Kyle watching, I love you, hon. Bye.